All right, let's turn our focus here now with just over a week to go ahead of the ANC National Conference. All eyes remain on NASREC and the jostling for positions that will take place there. For more on what ANC leaders are doing ahead of the conference, we are now joined by SABC Politics editor Mzondile Mbeje, who is in studio with me. Mzondile, thank you so much for your time. Of course, uh, ANC faced with a number of issues, you know, ahead of its national uh, conference, particularly around the Palapala Pala matter. But let's talk now about the national conference because yeah. it is a few days to go. What are some of the leaders doing currently? Well, thank you very much and uh, obvious good afternoon to, to the viewers. Um, the fact of the matter, as you've uh, correctly said it, so they are faced with these challenges. In fact, uh, in a few minutes' time, so we'll be speaking to one of the leaders uh, from the Eastern Cape, uh, Oscar Mabuyan, uh, my colleague Samgele is there. Mm -hmm. uh, but basically what is, going, is happening and what we are understanding as um, the SAPC as well is that the leaders uh, from across the provinces are so worried about the state of affairs of the party in general that um, perhaps in a day or two, they are likely to meet, I think, either in Gauteng or uh, Deben or KZN, where they may try to see if they can come up with a united, agreed leadership. They are already in a divided state, and I think they wouldn't want that to go on. But of course, uh, I don't know whether it's too late for them to do that, but we do understand that the efforts are underway to try and perhaps get to agree on leadership. Because, yes, um, it, elections uh, are a democratic process, but they are divisive. And I don't think the ANC can afford any further divisions amongst themselves. Already the issue of Palapala Pala is dividing them further. So, and um, I think uh, uh, my colleague will also be able to explore some of those matters uh, with uh, Oscar Mabuyan as he'll be speaking to him. I mean, it makes the playing field of contesting a little bit harder because there are all these leadership dynamics. And, you know, of, of course, they're also questioning just the whole process about even electing, um, you know, um, the new National Executive Committee members uh, per se. What are all these developments doing in terms of having to focus on policy, which is the key thing, you know, around this national conference? You know, uh, actually, they are. this is a democratic space, and whatever they are doing is supposed in a normal society or in a normal environment, supposed to be okay. Mm. But then they find themselves so divided by so many issues. And I can tell you now, in the past three weeks or so, no one will tell you, um, so what are the key issues they will be discussing other than their issues of division, their issues of palapala, pala, their issues of uh, how to approach the conference. So the issues that South Africans are really worried about. Remember, at the end of the day, so those leaders are entrusted with the responsibility of giving de uh, service delivery. As a country, as you and I sit here, we are exper experiencing load shedding. Those leaders that we elect, we expect them to be able to put uh, efforts, strategies, measures in place to be able to deal with all those kinds of things. Those are the questions we should be worried about, not necessarily who uh, will replace who. At the end of the day, so are South Africans benefiting from that? And I think that's what perhaps uh, informs the leadership of the ANC from across the provinces to say, maybe instead of focusing on these divisions, let's sit down, let's perhaps come up with one united leadership so that the sole uh, focus now will be to serve the people of South Africa. But whether that will be possible or not, given that we are just nine days away from the conference, is, uh, is anybody's guess, really. Uh, fantastic. Mzondele, thank you so much for your time. In fact, let's now see what one of those leaders has to say about the national conference that is happening uh, in, you know, in a couple of days' yeah. time.